So one of the things that um, might be worth investigating further is kind of the ability to work with things um, mentally and you know in your head and um, how that is for you if you if you can imagine being in a virtual situation. So things like um, do you find it easy doing sums in your head? No. Okay. Um, and do you type? Do you take a long time to copy things down? Things that might be incomprehensible to you. Um, long sentences that might be really um, difficult, where you might simultaneously be hearing somebody talking to you. Do you find it um, that you take a long time to copy things down like that? I don't know. Have you experienced sometimes people getting angry with you or upset because you get the wrong idea about what you're trying to say? Yeah. Yes. Good. Um, and do you report difficulties with timekeeping and self-organisation at all? I mean, obviously those are issues about management of yourself in your whatever environment you're in. But, it, but is self-organisation a problem for you? Do you, did, you, did you struggle with sports and games at school when you were younger? When you were at school, maybe at primary school or even secondary school, I suppose. Was that an issue for you? No. Okay. Do you find it difficult to work out how much several items will cost? That refers back to that previous question that we talked about, about uh, mental arithmetic. Um, but do you find it difficult to work out how much several items will cost if you go in a shop or something? Uh, sometimes, yeah. Okay. So do you find it difficult to get your ideas down in writing in a logical order? I don't know what you mean. So do you find it difficult to hard to follow what people say are saying in a group situation? No. Yeah. Do you report being able to do things easily on one day and then another day not be able to do them? We've only got we've only got another page, so we'll keep going through it because it'd be good to get it all done and out of the way, and then we can talk about the other um, issues and the consequences of of the order. Um, when you start a task, do you find it difficult to know where to begin? No. Okay. Do you like to try things out, new things, and find new ways of doing things? Don't get it. Sorry. Okay, we'll miss that one out. Do you find it hard to understand difficult or complicated instructions? Yeah. Okay. We'll we'll stop there now. Hi Damien, um, just wanted to spend some time in this session thinking about how we might be able to help support you in this situation. Um, trying to think about what's easy for you and maybe what's harder for you and think whether there's anybody who can help you or support you so that you get what you need. How does that sound? Yeah, okay. Okay. So I've got I've got some questions here. Um but really it's more of a chat. I just need to write some things down so that I remember what I'm saying, otherwise I'll forget. Um and I just want you to be as honest with me as possible. Because it's really about you and about how we can help you and get the support that you need. Okay? So the first part is about school, really. How, how did you get on at school? Um, yeah, that's all right. 
sometimes. So there were some bits that were okay? Yeah. And the rest of the time? It's like, um, quite hard sometimes. Yeah. yeah. What, what was hard about it? Like, um, reading and um, writing, maths and stuff. So the schoolwork bit, the actual getting yeah. things down was difficult? Yeah. I get all my mates and stuff. Right, so you had some good, good friends. Yeah. But the written yeah. stuff was hard. Okay. Do you have to fill in forms and stuff now? Do you have to do any writing now? What do you mean? Well, things like you might have had forms from your solicitor or right. things uh, that you yeah. have to write about yourself. Yeah. And how's that? So, from, like they're long, they're yeah. quite hard. Can you let me know what's hard about it? This is so boring. Yeah. <laughs> and some words as well, quite hard. So, maybe making sense of the words that are written down there? Yeah. And what about you actually writing down stuff, is that...? I don't like writing. Right. It's boring and hard. Yeah. So do you think maybe that might be something that we could find some support for you with? Okay. If you have to write stuff down? Yeah. Yeah, okay, okay. All right. Um, thinking about when other people are talking to you, I mean, I suppose back at school, um, or maybe in, in this situation, do you find it easy to understand what people are saying? Or is that difficult too? Yeah, sometimes. Sometimes. Yeah. Um, sometimes it's... the question? Sorry. I'm just wondering if it's hard or, diff or easy to understand what other people are saying. Uh, easy. Sometimes. With mates it's easy, but in school and court, it's, I don't really know what they're on about. Right, so some of the words yeah. maybe? They and go and then ask someone what they're talking about. Right, and maybe using long sentences, that yeah. might be hard. Yeah. So people need to, you find it easier to understand if people are speaking short sentences and using yeah. words that you know more. Yeah. Okay, okay, all right. All right, um, this is a bit of an unusual question, a bit strange question, but Thinking about other times that you that you knock into things or that you trip over. Can you can you remember the last time that you tripped over? No. No. So that's no. not something that you do. Sometimes. Well, I I have like a couple of times. A couple of times. Trip, tripped over. Or when was the last time? Do you remember? Last week. Okay, so it's not something that happens every no. day or anything like that. Okay, that's great. Okay, what about um, finding your way around places? How is it, you know... Difficult. Right. Yeah. Um, shops and school. Um, so have you got... Was it a big school you went to? Yeah, yeah. School? yeah. At first it was really hard. Yeah. So How I didn't know where I was going. I had to like ask someone or ask a mate or something. And um, what happened later? Did you manage to find? Yeah, yeah. But I'll, I'll be late or something. Right. So. Um, yeah, but like, if people ask me like where to go, I I, I won't know. So, right. Okay. So, so letting people know where yeah, to yeah. go is hard. Yeah. But also you finding yeah. your way around is sometimes hard. So you ask other people. Yeah. That's a good good strategy. Yeah. Um, and I suppose knowing that that's sometimes difficult. Yeah. Means at least you know how to find help maybe okay all right okay so let's think about how you how you use your time if you have three things say that you have to get done in a day how do you organize that if you have to do I don't know go and get some bread and come here and go and pick something up another thing up from the shop how do you um, well so like if I'm told on the day what I've got to do, then I'll do it. 
but like um, like if it's a like birthday or something, I don't really know. I I forget. I forgot my sister's birthday, which was bad. Yeah. Because um, I wasn't told on the day, so. No. So you need to have reminders. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, and what to do? What kind of reminders do you have? Do you write them down, or do you put them in your phone? Or well, my, no, my mum tells me a lot what I've got to do because she knows I'm forgetful. Right. So, um, yeah, I forget to write things. I, I, yeah, I should write things down. I suppose that's hard though. If, if writing's hard yeah. for you, maybe then yeah. then that can be difficult. Yeah. So you rely on other people yeah, yeah. to help with that. Yeah. So actually, we need to find a way to help you with that because if you're going to be living on your own at some point then we need to find a way that you can have those reminders without having people having to pop up and tell you yeah. so that would be yeah. so, one, one thing to help you out with yeah okay all right i'll make a note of that okay how are you doing are you all right yeah you need a break or are you Soon. Okay, okay. Well. Alright, we'll do another couple of questions and then and then we'll have a break and then we'll come back. If that's okay? Yeah. Okay, alright.